specialize in providing communication services, broadband services uh, in areas that otherwise would be neglected. farmers, you know, and there are some small mom and pop type businesses. Uh, most of our, our customers are residential. Nowadays with broadband is, is critical for people doing schoolwork. You know, you got to get online as far as working from your home. Uh, these things are important for, for rural areas. Kids are on devices all the time here. We draw students in our school program from three different communities, as far as 45 minutes each direction. So in order for those families to be able to see what's going on, to hear what's going on, to understand, even things like grades, assignments, um, things like broadband, connectivity are really, really important. One of the key pieces of that is to have access. You know, it used to be that education was where you went to get knowledge. Now the internet's where you go to get knowledge. For a rural community that, it, it, that wants to be a thriving community, you have to be connected. We have people from all different worlds and all different income levels. So being that we have multiple different opportunities here, we have to be well versed in all different programs and, and specifically what people are looking for. I go back a long time in the real estate industry and there was a time that we had books and each property got maybe six or ten lines. Now with the internet it has totally changed the way we do business but if you don't have good broadband you're buffering and that's a problem. Without the broadband service that we have we would not be able to provide the services to our clients. You look at everything from a business standpoint, and that's the way we've looked at the Huawei solution. It was definitely a practical way to go. We actually did what you know what the regulators want us to do to provide broadband service to reach these areas that, uh, in the most economical way. What you want is somebody who is who's going to hear you and are going to take action. We're going to address the issues you have, and that's what I have. That's what I've had with them. They've been great when we made that decision five, six years ago to go with their, their solution, we knew there would be some, you know, some risk because there were accusations made. But over the years, I've never heard any, I've never see, received any proof. And if there were proof, if there was hard proof that this is a possible security threat, I, you know, I'm, I'm a patriot, I wouldn't jeopardize our national security just for a buck. I think of Huawei as a partner. <laughs>